What's up guys, welcome back to another edition of Unsanctioned Fabrication. I've got a project here. I have to remove the blue tint on the stainless steel tank and my acid machine broke. We actually pushed it past its duty cycle, started smoking, you know, basically we trashed it just because again, we weren't, we, I never expected I could burn out the machine. But in my scrambling, I did a little research. I found out that uh, somebody else was successful using their TIG welder. So they were able to turn their TIG welder down way low on DC, they got it down to like five amps. My machine does not go down that low. It only goes down to 20 amps. That is way too powerful for this. This is actually a replacement brush found on Amazon. It is an eight millimeter carbon fiber brush. These are very cheap. They are available. You can find them, just have to hunt for them. Now, I actually modified my TIG torch to accept an actual eight millimeter. Cut the nozzle off, drilled, tapped on here. Drilled and tapped and uh, put my cable in through the handle. So, and then now you have this Frankenstein thing here. I'm still gonna use my Dynaflux solution because that's what I have. Replacement machine should be around $1,000 to $2,000 depending on which brand you buy. This is obviously beat the crap, but this should be free. Yeah, you know, nobody would ever sell you something that looks this beat the hell. But 12 volts, 40 amp running right now. Put it in reverse polarity. Make sure you're all juiced up. Does the job. <laughs> this is a hack and a half. This is probably my hack of the year. I'm gonna buy a new machine for about $150 right now. <laughs> and honestly, I'm, I'm gonna save a lot of money doing this. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Yeah, we really appreciate it. Take care, be safe out there, and be careful tinkering around with electricity. Give me a thumbs up, really appreciate it, and don't forget to subscribe.